I'm Nash Rhodes and this is an OU TV weather brief. Now across the state today, it's been fairly warm. We're actually about 10 degrees above average for this time of year and looking at the uh, 24 hour temperature change, you can really see that we've really gotten a lot warmer. Oklahoma City sitting at 18 degrees warmer than we were this time yesterday. So why is this happening? Uh, how far uh, is this going to last before it changes? Let's jump into the regional view and find out. Uh, you'll quickly see we have a lot of strong winds now moving in from the south and that's bringing in a lot of warm moist air from the Gulf of Mexico that's working to fuel those temperatures. However, we are going to see a shift in those winds as this pressure system to our north is going to drop down into the northern part of the state as early as Friday. Now, Friday afternoon around 2 p.m. is when we're going to see this cross into our state's border. And as it moves through the state, keep an eye on these temperatures. They'll drop rapidly all the way into the teens in some places. Guyman sitting at 19, 18 degrees as this moves through. Now, it will also give a chance of precipitation. Looking at uh, the uh, precipitation types. If you're in the extreme southeastern portion of the state, you will likely experience some weak thunderstorms. However, only a 20% chance of precipitation in the central and northwestern portions of the state where you could see light snow or a winter mix. So looking at the highs for tomorrow, highs will be in the mid 60s as we continue to climb uh, before that cold front does come through. And looking at the seven day forecast, we will take a dip before we rise to round out the week. This has been an OU TV weather brief. Have a great night. Good job.